Hey y'all, I'm back with the YMCA or Simple Texas. We just wanted to show you a few options. We're gonna do a leg workout right now. Um, remember that we have recorded content from our YMCA instructors uploaded to our Facebook page, that Y Facebook page for you anytime you want to. So let's say you've warmed up. Maybe you've gone out and taken a run or a walk. The weather's supposed to be great this week. And now you want to come in, do a little extra leg work. So I'm going to show you some things you can do. I'm going to start with a clean and press. I just need one weight, and you can choose your weight. Or you don't have to use a weight at all. I'll show you modifications as well. So my toes, my legs are split with different apart. My toes are forward or slightly out. I'm going to hinge, squat down. Grab that weight. My palm is facing back. I'm going to bring it all the way up to a press. And then take it down. Switch hands. All right? Now, let's say you want to modify that a little bit. This time, don't take it down as low. You don't squat as low. Take it to those knees. Bring it up. Make it one fluid movement. All right? So we're keeping doing these. We're going to do about 20 of them. And then we're going to move into some sumo squats. Yeah. Who's counting? Because I lost count. Just good. I think I know where we are. Keeping that chest lifted. This is another one of those double blessing exercises. Because I'm using my upper body as well as my lower body. Double blessing. Give me about 10 more. Ten. Nine. Good. Keep it up. That's the way. Six. Four. Three. Two. And one. All right. Don't cheat on that last one. Don't quit before you before it's time. Yeah, pick up both legs. We're going to go to the sumo squat. Sumo squat's a little different. Think of those sumo wrestlers. You know how they walk. I take my toes out towards the walls. My stance is wide. My weight is still in my heels. But instead of pushing my glutes back, taking them down and up. That's helping that pelvis. All right, check out your knees. Take a look at them. Where are they? Are they sticking out beyond your toes? If they are, widen that stance. You want to protect your knees. If you hurt your knees, you're sidelined. You can't keep working out. So protect your knees. Press into those heels. Good. Keep it up. Now we're going to drop 10 more like this. Then we're going into a pulse. It's going to be great. Eight. Nine. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. Come down and hold. All right. Now pulse. One, two, three. Do that. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. More. Ten, nine, eight, seven. Shoulder, shoulder back. Five, four, three, two, and one. All right. Now we're going to go into some deadlifts. You know, we neglect our hamstrings. We really do. You've got muscle balance. So you've got a really strong quad, and your hamstrings weak. You're going to get an injury. So don't neglect it. Let's make sure we work it out. We're hinging forward. It's like you're in your bedroom and you're shutting that dresser drawer with that butt. I'm going down flat back. I'm not grabbing. All right, keep those eyes looking forward in front of you and come up. Oh, I feel my glutes, my hamstrings. They are working to lift me. 
Give me ten of these. We don't need to go fast. We go fast. We risk getting messy. And then rounding our back, hurting ourselves, hurting that lower back. You can do this without weights as well. Still working those hamstrings. Okay, I'm putting in a few extra things. These are so good. Give me five. Five. Four. Three. Two. And one. Now let's go to some calf raises. You don't have to have weights for this. You can just come up on your toes and take it back down, just like that. Now, if you want to add more into that, go single leg. All right, you're bringing that balance in, as well as really loading. Woo, one leg. Remember that the YMCA is offering Studio Sweat on demand to all our YMCA members during this time as well. We want to make sure that y'all stay healthy. That you come back to us and you're not starting over again. That you've been working out even while we're not together. Okay, I'm gonna do five more on this side, then I'm gonna switch. It's kind of all over the place. Three, four, one more. Now switch it. You're at about 15. You can do more if you want. Ten more, y'all. Ten. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Now, I'm going to put the weights down. We're going into the plyo's lit line. Remember, the plyo means jump. So you can hear the word plyo, you know you're going to jump. You don't have to jump, though. All right, so I can be down here and jump, jump, random, soft, just like that. Or I can step it back, step it back. I'm still looking for a 90 degree bend in that front leg, pressing into that heel. Give me a few more. Right leg equals one, y'all. Six, five, four, three, two, one. Good. All right. Now, do those legs. You can do it again. Do it three more times. Ready to do it just that one time with me? It's all good. Thank you. We'll see you later.